Well, in Game 5, the better team prevailed, and that team was Cleveland. So the Tigers, their miracle run is over. Cleveland winning 7-3. to uh, They went down one nothing, but then in the bottom of the 5th, they scored 5 runs. Tigers battled back to make it 5-3, but the Guardians with another run in the bottom of the 7th, another run in the bottom of the 8th to win the game 7-3. to uh, They score 5 earned runs off of Tariq Skubal, all of them coming in the 5th inning. It's Tariq Skubal. Still struck out six, but he struggled later in that start. They also got a run off of Will Vest and Tyler Holton, so the Tigers pitching staff kind of crumbled. And the Guardians, how'd they do it? Huge part of it goes to Lane Thomas. Dude was on his game. Two for four with a home run, five runs batted in. Jose Ramirez also manages an RBI, as does Brian Rocio and Stephen Kwan with his third straight three-hit game. All that guy does is hit the baseball. He goes three for five with two runs scored, and the Guardians were all over Detroit. Matthew Boyd was the starter. Two innings, no earned runs, five strikeouts, and then it was the bullpen went the rest of the way. Cade Smith, Eric Sabrowski, Andrew Walters, Tim Heron, Hunter Gaddis, Eli Morgan, and Emmanuel Classe, who redeems himself from his earlier struggles by going two scoreless innings to close out the game, Detroit, they got their runs, RBIs from Colt Keith, Jake Rogers, and Kerry Carpenter. But it was ultimately a tough game in a tough way for Detroit to go out on the season.